in this video we're going to be taking a look at Ratatascar's newest skin coming to the game, Curious Critter Ratatoskr. Now, I just do not like this skin. I'm going to just start off with that. First of all, it's a limited skin that is just plain. It's not it's not a bad skin. I think they were going for like a squirrel feel with this because he's like inner city. When he's in his ultimate, he jumps up on light poles. But like... This is a limited skin that you can only get through the gold vault. And I guess we'll say that right now. The only way to get this skin, you have to go over to the adventure mode, which is not... Oh, there it is. Adventure mode, go to the gold vault, you purchase it with the gold key. So the, and when you go to the gold vault, they usually have all these really cool skins. And then Curious Critter is thrown in there. And it, I just... I don't get it, guys. If you like this skin, let me know. Am I just too picky? But, like, this is... This is plain. And even the voice pack, when I was doing the skin showcase, I had to go back and listen to default rat's voice pack because I I thought it was just the default. Chase the enemy. I'll attack. Like I'll attack middle lane. I'll defend There's lane. just really no difference. The only thing that I could tell there was difference, I think, is when you do the taunts and the jokes, they're like inner city taunts. So like that is the only thing that led me to believe maybe the voice pack isn't wrong, but I, I'm still not even sure, to be honest with you. Overall, I'm not crazy about this skin. He's literally just a plain Ratatoskr that looks a little more squirrel-like, and he's got street clothes on. I did notice just now his shoes literally have acorns at the tip of them, and that's freaking adorable. Other than that, though, yeah, I don't know how I feel about this. Without further ado, we're going to jump into a game, take a look at his abilities and all that good stuff. Okay, we are back, and I'm going to go ahead and buy the acorn real quick, just so you can see what that animation looks like. I think we have to be out of the fountain. Get a little preview of his dash. Um, he, Man, I just... I, this might be the hardest I've ever critiqued a skin. Uh, we'll just throw that out there. So, the acorn purchase. Pretty simple. Nothing too crazy. The acorn doesn't look a whole lot different. This is the one thing I do like about this skin, and when I saw this, it like a light bulb ticked off i think this is kind of the same theme as that thoth skin it was like geek beak thoth i think but he was basically a hipster and it was just plain he was just in like street clothes but when he walked wait what oh it's only if you're in combat when he walked he had that same pattern underneath him so i'm thinking it's that and i did not like that skin so yeah that that is a nice little feature i do like that but it's only active when you're in combat the dash is just plane it's like a little jet puff of smoke and then like some leaves that's literally it um and then when you hit somebody nothing really too different the only effect that's even in the skin is leaves when you basic attack leaves get thrown up when you dash leaves get thrown up when you alt leaves get thrown up that's literally it it's just a plain skin for a limited gold vault skin i don't get it i really don't get it Again, that's that's pretty cool. I do like the the nice like brick street brick that's going on, and then the leaves get thrown up. The acorns kind of sounded like bowling balls a little bit. I don't know. I I just I usually try to remain like open minded about a skin, even if I don't like the theme. I try to just go into it as if I did like the theme, but like I just don't get it. Why is it limited? Why is it in the gold vault? There's nothing to it. It's it's a plain Ratatoskr that looks like a squirrel. <laughs> That's it. This is the only cool thing. His ult is awesome. He literally, because he's inner city, he's a squirrel, he just bounces around on light poles. That's awesome. That I like. But that's really it. I don't know. I don't know, guys. You let me know in the comments what you think. Am I just being too hard, or is this skin really as underwhelming as I'm making it out to be? Um, we'll go ahead and do the voice pack real quick and see that. Holy! You're awesome! Cancel that. It... I've got this. Like, I can't tell. Is this the correct voice pack, or is this basic Ratatasker? I really don't know. Oh. <laughs> they clearly use the same voice actor, that's for sure. <laughs> don't be grumpy, grumpy. Cheer up. In the other direction, please. I do like that taunt. I take it you haven't been out of the city before. That right there. I take it you haven't been out of the city. That's what leads me to believe that, yeah, that's the correct voice pack for the skin, but... Please don't rain negativity on me. It's a beautiful day. Sorry, but you're making me feel uncomfortable. 
His taunts and everything are really good, though. That's the thing. Pleasure is eating leftover picnic food. Well, that's not weird, is it? Yeah, like a little squirrel scavenging for picnic food. So it all makes sense now. The voice pack's actually really nice. That's probably the brightest spot about it. tend to stick to hiking backcountry rivers because they're less mainstream. <laughs> that was good. That was a good joke. Ew. I have a blister on my blister. It's evolving. Oh, this can't be normal, right? A blister on my blister, it's evolving. I don't get that at all. Yeah, so, final analysis. Concept for the skin, underwhelming. The fact that it's limited and in the gold vault, absurd. The voice pack's actually awesome. I love the taunts, I love the jokes, but... <laughs> <laughs> that should have been put into more effort to the skin as well. That is it for this one, guys. If you enjoyed it, be sure to drop a like, hit subscribe for more content. Relax. Social media links in the description. And thank you for watching. Climbing trees is the best.